Hey everybody, Johnny Arclight here. Welcome back to Doorways. So in the last episode, we walked across a maze of rotten planks uh, filled with creepy ladies. I think it was the same creepy lady that just kept showing up over and over and over again. And uh, now we're entering this weird compound. We're searching for some sort of serial killer, I believe. I'm not really sure what's going on yet. What? What's that noise? Suppose they're going up. <gasps> oh, stop! Oh shit, no! Is that gonna happen as soon as I step on them? Oh, okay. We good. Ooh, yep. <laughs> Spooky. Stop it. I just got sliced open. I don't think so. I really want to see... Something I can like throw in there? What about this? Can I like touch it and make it go off? No. It's gotta be. Oh, hello! There we go. sake. Alright, I get it though. Yeah, yeah, war games with their hard-ons for traps. Yep. Oh, they go up and stay up to block my path back. That's nice. Well, at least I'm going in the right direction, I suppose. Okay, hello everyone. It's good to see you all here. Thank you, I've asked you to gather here today. Um, whew, okay, let's see here. Not like that. What is this? Oh, hello. Okay, I did something. What's this? Hundreds of people were tortured in this timeless place. What is this castle doing here? I could swear that there were no buildings or ruins like this in these woods. Many of the victims were prisoners of war, but some, some are much more recent. Of those I can see, I can look through their eyes. All of them are males, prisoners, yes, but there were no wars being fought when they were caught. They were kidnapped, one by one, and brought here by the professor. 
Might he see himself as a righteous man? An emissary of God? Does he? Well, he's pretty crazy then. Uh... Cool. So, do I need to go back now? Where did I even come from? This way. Yes? No? Yes? Yes. Oh! Son of a bitch! God damn it. Now we should be able to open the doors, right? Oh, I thought that was a growl. And it horrified me for a second. No? The other direction now? Alright. Suppose there's another lever I need to get. Whoa! Say like claw wheel forks cage. Claw wheel forks cage. Claw. Claw. Wheel. Forks. Cage. Claw. Wheel. Forks, cage, claw, good. Made it. What's, what's in this direction? Oh, another one, huh? Claw, we. Nope. Claw, forks, wheel cage. Claw, forks, wheel cage. Claw. Forks, wheel, cage, claw, forks, wheel, cage. But that didn't, that just took me in a circle. Alright, let's try again. Claw, forks, wheel, cage, claw, forks, wheel, cage, claw, Forks, wheel, cage, claw, forks, wheel, cage, claw, 
forks. Jump! Alright. Oh my god! People being burnt? This, this game is messed up, dude. Okay, well. Hey, look, I can pull you down. Lucky me. Yeah, that did something fun, I think. Yeah, let's go this way, I guess. Oh, good, no. At that moment, I remember wondering, is all of this just my imagination? Perhaps now I should add, or is it a figment of the broken memory of this maniac? Could the background of the tortured and murdered victims of this chamber have something to do with it? They were accused of witchcraft. Maybe something esoteric tainted their souls. And now, hundreds of years later, I'm being poisoned by their curse. This line of thought made me remember one of the details of the investigation that brought me to this place. A girl had gone missing in the proximity of these woods. An unfortunate teenager that, after some inquiries, I linked to Wiccan practices. Had she been kidnapped and tortured to pay for her heresies? I don't know, ma'am. But we should leave. Oh boy. Claw, claw, wheel, forks, forks, cage. Claw, claw, wheel, forks, forks, cage. Claw, claw, wheel, forks, forks, cage. Claw, claw. Wheel. That'll do. Another one. Claw, wheel, forks, cage, forks, wheel, claw. Claw, wheel, forks, cage, and then backwards. that there's something in there how do I get to that huh Forks, cage, forks, I'm out. Alright. Open sesame. Now I can actually go in. Excellent! felt great relief when I left behind those sinister dungeons with their dark halls and their whispers. The presence of those accusing, tortured souls was killing me at every step. I didn't do this! Once in the clearing, the tranquility of having found an exit was interrupted by the sudden notion of my finding me once again in the dark woods. Those haunting shadows were starting to drive me insane. 
still, something kept me moving forward. I knew I was closer than ever to the place I needed to find. I was determined to discover the truth. Whoever was responsible would pay for the suffering he caused. Alright, let's find this maniac. Well, I guess we're gonna pop this bad boy out again. About to go out. Yep. No thank you, man. Whoever was whispering behind me can go to hell. Oh, what is this? Something spooky this way comes. Whew, alright. We're gonna explore this house, I think. We're gonna do it in the next episode. This is getting real weird, real fast. Super creepy. I'm liking it now. I just want to know what exactly the story is, because it looks like we're after, like, maniacs, so, like, serial killers? Are we here to punish them? Like, what is our purpose here? Join me in the next episode, and we will explore some more and see what lies in wait in this twisted world. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, do what you guys do best, and I will see you guys again in the next episode. Bye bye <laughs>